Hello everyone, welcome to Ivy Pro School's YouTube channel. Today we are going to do an analysis on the pizza dataset. We will create a dashboard using Tableau to analyze the orders and sales and discuss the insights and recommendations. Let us understand the data set first. So our data set consists of four tables. The first is the orders table. The second is the orders detail table. The third is the pizza table. And the fourth is the pizza type table. So we have done an inner join of all the tables and created the dashboard. And we have here the orders dashboard and the revenue dashboard. This is our orders dashboard. So here we see that on the top, the total number of orders placed in 2015 is 21,350 and the average order price would be $37.56. If we see day-wise, then here we notice that on Fridays, maximum number of orders are placed followed by Saturday and then the rest of the days of the week but we notice here that on Sundays, there is a fall in the number of orders placed. If we analyze our wise, so we notice that the peak hours are between 12 noon to 1 p.m. That is the lunch time. Then we see a fall and then there is again a rise between 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. Now let us consider the weekend separately. So here we see that. The 12 p.m. to 1 p.m. is no more the peak hour for us unlike the other days, but we get more orders in between 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. In this chart, we see that the large size of pizza is the most preferred size, followed by medium and then the small, whereas XL and double XL are not performing well as compared to the other sizes. Category wise, we can see that. Classic is the most sold category, whereas for large we have the ready, for medium we have classic again, and for, and for small we have classic again. To analyze category wise, we see that classic is the most preferred category. In large, we have the veggie, but we also notice that chicken has only been at the bottom. So we can say that chicken is not performing well. For XL and double XL, we see that the number of orders are very low. That is because we don't offer much variety for these two sizes. Next, we move on to the revenue dashboard. Here we have the total revenue as. $817,860 and category wise we see that classic contributes most to the revenue followed by supreme, then the chicken and then the veggies. We had seen that veggies were the veggies got the most sales in the large categories but it's not contributing much to the sales. We will now summarize our insights. Number one. The number of orders placed and the revenue generated on Sunday is the least. So, we can offer some combo meal plans or discount on Sundays to generate more revenue. Number two, during weekends, the peak hours are between 12 p.m. to 2 p.m. During the weekends, the peak hours are between 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. So, we can offer some happy hour plans or some one-on-one -on -one offers during the drop hours. Number three, Large is the preferred size of which veggie pizzas are the most ordered. So we can give some discount on other categories of pizzas of large sales, of large size. Number four, irrespective of size, chicken pizzas are the least ordered, but the revenue earned by chicken pizzas are more than that of veg pizzas. So we can adopt some marketing strategies and advertisement to promote the sales of pizzas of the chicken category. Number five, only classic pizzas are available in XL and double XL sizes, thereby decreasing their count of orders. 
to increase the sales of Excel and Double Excel, we can offer the most sold PFAS available in, in these sizes also. So this was the analysis done for the PFAS set. I hope you liked it. Thank you.